I'm trying to trying to eat right. So thank you for using the door again. That's, that's very nice. We like the door. Welcome. It's it's Monday. Start of week four of FRC build season. Lots of things going on. I'm going to touch on them a little bit. So come on in. So team update six came out Friday, and there's a lot there's a lot of nuances going on in team update six. I recommend you read it. Ruth knows more about this than I do. So. If you're slow placing a cube, the people that you're going up against can't force you to get a penalty by placing a cube faster than you're placing your cube by making the platform hit up into your robot. They also made that general strategy by, oh, well, I'm being really slow at placing the cube. Uh, so I'm going to maintain control longer illegal. One of the other things they also changed, folks are talking about maybe playing some games with uh, the fact that you don't have to declare parts that cost under $5 in your $4,000 cost. And they added that those parts have to be sold by a vendor as defined in the rule book. Thanks Ruth. I saw something on Twitter that was a, a team that was talking about revving up their green compliant wheels to like 8,000 RPM. First of all, no, don't do that. We do have RPM ratings on our web pages, so there is a rating for each one, and the softer they are, the lower the rating is. As they go faster, that thing called centrifugal force expands the wheel, and actually, it will break the wheel if, it, if you go too fast. Check out our web pages for um, RPM ratings of the compliant wheels. You're not going to be in trouble, just don't go crazy spinning these things at 10,000 RPM. Many of our parts have more information on the downloads tab on the product webpage. There's the information tab, and there's the downloads tab. The downloads tab will have CAD files, layout prints, even, even assembly drawings and that kind of stuff to help you know more about our products. Right now it says we have a three to four uh, business day backlog. It just takes us time to get those orders picked and packed and shipped out the door. And we're catching up now. So I was actually, this morning, I was out packing a few orders myself. So thanks for your patience as we are getting to your order. If there's something that you see is wrong and we're missing something, just give us a call and we'll make things right. A couple of cool things I've seen out in the, in the internet, just uh, team feedback and team announcements and such. I did see that Team 319, Big Bag Bob, they, I say Big Bag Bob? FRC Team 319, Big Bad Bob, they put out their CAD for this year already. So if you have no idea what to design, if you don't know what to do, and you're, you have a lot of manufacturing resources, you can do it really quickly, go look at their CAD design. They've released it for all of us to see. So the intent there is to, is to inspire and go ahead and use it as you wish for your team, from what I hear. They're also encouraging teams to reach out if they see errors in the CAD or if they want help on implementing some of those solutions in their own designs. 319 will be more than happy to work with them on helping with, with that. Cool. So the CAD is Onshape CAD, so it's pretty easy to get at that if you have Onshape, obviously. Also, there's some sharing of, of auto mode code. So check out Upper Creek Robotics, which is 1619 out of Colorado. They have a repository for Auto modes. Also, 319 is putting their auto modes in there, and I think they want more people to put their auto mode codes into there. It'd be nice if we had um, different types of auto modes and all kinds of programming LabVIEW, C, Java. Punch card. A punch card. I want to see those punch card auto modes. Those, that would be great. We do have a winner for our contest. So, this team, they've, they've put together really good entries every single week. All three weeks they've had a top entry. This is Team Horsepower from Munster, Indiana, and uh, I think they're they're poking at this um, targeting light. Touchpad. Gosh, I, I never can remember what that word is. I think my favorite part is over here. It says, "Everybody clap your hands." You know what that means? So. Cha cha slide. What? No, not cha cha slide. It's the it's the Cupid, not the Cupid. No, yeah, it's cha cha slide. Right. We got to go to the tape. Okay. I'm getting ready. Good job. FRC 3147. These Indiana teams are bringing it. So you guys, the rest of you guys need to need to step it up. There's two Indiana teams that have won out of the three three weeks. And the third team was um, 128 from Ohio. So Midwest represent right here. A new picture. I think I know those people. It's kind of hard to see who all is in this. I think it's, so this is a new picture. It gives you three different characters to mess with. You got, we got some first staff back here behind the alliance wall. Uh, I don't know what 
JB is doing. It's never the wrong time for that noise. You've got Alex, you've got Jamie, and you've got JB. Not sure what, what Jamie is doing there. Maybe She's right. yelling at JB. She's yelling. Okay. Well, he, he, he probably he, deserves it. He's in the wrong video and he's kicking the rollers. Oh, yeah. That, okay, that's kicking. Oh, yes. I, I didn't. So he's he likes kicking the rollers. I see. Okay. <laughs> it's never the wrong time for that noise. Be creative. Have fun. Keep it G-rated. This is pretty much, we're just now getting into FRC build season crunch time. This is when we start losing track of our homework and we don't, we, we get behind at school or we don't take care of our dog at home or our spouses or our kids. Be a good teammate. Be aware of the people that you're impacting, that you're putting in these 16, 18 hour days. And um, I know it's a lot of hard work and it's going to pay off but be patient with each other and um, most of all, be safe. During this time of hustling, you sometimes want to cut corners, so be safe as you're working on your robots. There was a time when I built, like six, seven years ago, I built most of the shifters, and then we hired people to do those building things. So I think I'm gonna go build shifters today. So for those of you guys who are ordering Evo shifters, some of them might be built by me. We have a crew of people building just Evo shifters. So thank you for your orders. And uh, have a great week, and we will see you on Wednesday. Alec. Alex. 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 For some reason, I thought it was Alec. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Okay.